Congratulations, Eric and Christina. I'm a little older. I got some prepared. I hope you got a little a couple minutes. <laughs> I'd like to thank Bob and Connie, Kevin and Colleen, Jack and Kathy, Pastor Salcedo, Troy and Heidi, Ellen and Melissa, Lucas and Tammy, Connie, everyone who helped put this celebration together. I guess this is usually when the uh, father gets so choked up he can't really handle it. <laughs> but, well, after 33 years of dance lessons, dance recitals, ball camps, ball games, band trips, late nights worrying, U-Haul rentals, moving her to college, moving her to apartments, moving her to, to a house, home repairs, house repairs, lawn mowing. I'd just like to say thank you, Eric, for taking it off my hands. summer, I thought, that's not very good timing. Her mom and I are trying to build a house this summer. <laughs> that's just not going to work out very well. But then she said, Dad, don't worry about it. I can talk Eric into go giving up his golf for three months to help you. <laughs> so thanks, Eric, for volunteering. <laughs> I suppose you're wondering how a girl from Ida Grove ended up in a small town like Holstein. <laughs> well, after five studious years at UNI, she comes home and lives in our basement. You're not making me sound pretty. <laughs> And she starts sending out resumes. <laughs> so, one day she comes up to me and she goes, Dan, I found a job in Dallas, Texas for a, for a professional photographer. I'm going to move to Dallas. And I got thinking, that's going to be a lot of work for Dad. <laughs> so I said, Christina, why don't you go down and talk to Don Knob? <laughs> And she said, oh, Dad, live in Ida Grove? <laughs> so she went down to talk to Don, and uh, they hit it off real well. God bless his soul. He set her up in a studio in Storm Lake with a business up there. Well, Don, he left life awful early, and we miss him a lot. But, continue, but Christina continued on the tradition taking over his business, buying it out, running a studio. And sometimes the expenses got a little high in Storm Lake, so she decided to hang her sign down in Holstein. Because she has some... She had some uh, friends that she went to dance class with and played ball against and stuff. And she moved to Holstein. So I'd just like to say thank you to all the people of Holstein for giving her a home. As you can tell, I'm not very good at speeches. But there is one, but one other person I'd like to thank. And that's that good-looking gal I met in the summer of 73. <laughs> My wife, Marcia, I love you a lot.
So I hope everybody enjoys tonight and has a good time. And again, congratulations to Christina and Eric. Thank you.